Well, hey there, everybody. Uh, welcome back to the channel. Hope you guys are having a, a good uh, good evening so far. I just got done with uh, picking up my last work stop and I'm uh, on the way to the office to drop all the, uh, all the stuff I picked up. But uh, I saw this as I was out working tonight and I didn't get a whole lot of time to uh, really delve delve into it until really basically right now and I might uh, go into it a little more in depth maybe possibly when I get home but uh, but Chicago Blackhawks owner Rocky Wirtz uh, passed away he just passed away earlier earlier uh, either either this afternoon or this evening at uh, at the age of 70 and uh, you know that's definitely uh, you know it's it's uh, you know kind of a blow to the Blackhawk organization. Obviously, I mean Rocky Wirtz. You know, I mean he he was the owner. Of, he was the owner that helped bring the Chicago Blackhawks back back to back to prominence. And. You know, I mean, the the Hawks, you know, under under him, had done, uh, you know, he he done they they done a lot of good a lot of good stuff, you know, and he he basically he took over he took over the Blackhawks at a time when they they weren't real good, but they were getting better, and they definitely. We're on the the upward trajectory because under the leadership of Rocky Wirtz, the Chicago Blackhawks won three Stanley Cups. Now, obviously, under Rocky Wirtz, there were some issues, to say the least. The whole you know the whole thing with Kyle Beach. That definitely is a is is a stain on on his uh, ownership legacy, and you know it's you know a bad 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 you know I mean bad stuff, man. You know I mean seeing seeing what all went down there with that situation. I mean, you know, a lot of a lot of people would think that 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 overshines or that outshines the the three championships that he helped uh, build. That he, you know, that he himself as the owner, along with with uh, uh, Stan Bowman, helped you know build up. And you know, it's you know, it's it's it's. It's it's never it's never fun. It's never fun to lose, you know. It's never fun to lose a parent. You know, I know I know uh, Danny Wirtz, uh, his son. I believe that's his son. Could be his daughter. Danny Wirtz. I I think it's his son though. I gotta think he will probably take over, and you know the Blackhawks will continue to be owned by the Wirtz family. The Blackhawks have been owned by the Wirtz family since 1954, when uh, Arthur Wirtz bought the Blackhawks in 1954. He then he then he owned the team for a while, and then and then uh, Bill Wirtz came in. That was uh, that was, I believe, Rocky's. Is that Rocky's dad? Yeah, that would have been Rocky's dad. Bill Wirtz would have been Rocky's dad. And, uh, you know, he, he owned the team for a long time. Owned them for a long time. Up until 2007. That's when I think, I believe, he passed away. Like I said, I'm just kind of, I'm kind of just, you know, going on the fly here with that. I might do a little more, more looking in, you know, get a little more accurate dates maybe when I get home 
but uh, so I'm kind of just flying by the seat of my pants here. I haven't looked at, haven't had a chance to really look up a lot of stuff about the Wirtz family, but I think I might probably do that when I get home. But, uh, but yeah, so Bill Wirtz owned them up until 2007. Then Rocky took over. And Rocky helped build the team into what they would become, which they would become a three-time Stanley Cup champion. And it's a team that has been going through some some perilous times again, but uh, they they win the draft lottery this last year or this this past uh, this this past. Uh, just a you know, month or so ago, and they draft Connor Bedard, who I think is going to be a really, really good player. And you know, and hopefully, hopefully the Blackhawks can can you know build themselves back up. You know, not only build themselves themselves back up into a playoff team. But hopefully maybe a Stanley Cup contender again. Because it's when when the Chicago Blackhawks and the Detroit Red Wings and the Toronto Maple Leafs, the Boston Bruins, when all the original six teams are competitive, that is that's 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 a good thing for the NHL. It's good for hockey when the original six teams are competitive. And if they can make the playoffs and all that, it's it's good. It's good for the league. It's it's money making for the league. It's good for ratings. It's good for a lot of things when the when the original six teams can be competitive. And so hopefully, you know, with uh, with Rocky's passing, you know, which you know again, you know, I mean, you know, I mean, obviously, you know. You know, thoughts and prayers go out to go out to the family, but uh, hopefully, under under Rocky's kids' leadership, the Blackhawks can to, can continue to to get better and be you know and potentially become that team that they were in the 2010s. You know, I mean, I I would love to see it. It's good for the game when that happens, and uh, and so yeah, hopefully, hopefully that can happen. But uh, for now, you know, you know, rest in peace, Rocky Wirtz. You were a pretty darn pretty darn good owner, and uh, I think your your team your team will be in good hands. I have no I have I have no doubt that your team will be in good hands with your uh, with your kids. And, uh, and yeah, so let me know what you guys think. You know, do you think the Blackhawks, you know, do, or do you think the Blackhawks will be in good hands under, uh, under Danny Wirtz and, uh, and the, uh, and Rocky's, uh, Rocky's family or Rocky's kids? You know, let me know what you guys think. If they'll be in good hands, I think they will be. I certainly hope they will be. And, uh, and yeah, so so again, let me know what you guys think in the comment section below. Like I said, I will probably do a little more digging into, uh, um, you know, like timelines and stuff like that. When, uh, and gotta love how my gotta, gotta love how sometimes my phone loves to go and you know disconnect then connect and then you know it's almost like a ghost starts starts my stuff up <laughs> even as I'm doing this so but let me know what you guys think I will probably do a little more uh, do a, go a little more in depth and uh, you know get some more number you'll know, get some get some numbers here on you know who took over when and all that I'll probably do that when I get home and I might do a video I'll probably do a, a little more in-depth video on that but uh, but let me know what you think in the comments section. You know, do you think the Blackhawks are will will uh you know continue to be in good hands? Love to know what you guys think. Uh 
hit that like button if you like the video hit that subscribe button if you really like the, if you really enjoy the video also if you want to be notified anytime uh, future videos are uploaded you can hit that little bell and it will notify you anytime future videos are uploaded I I'm knocking on the door of 2,000 subscribers and again I would love to uh, I have a goal I would love to hit I would love to hit 2,000 plus subscribers by my birthday which is September 8th and I would greatly greatly appreciate your guys as uh, help with that and uh, and yeah, you know, I'd love to, you know, I'd, I'd love for you all to, uh, to join me on the, uh, on this ride to 2000 to 2000 subscribers. And then, you know, after 2000 subscribers, you know, you know, up to maybe 3000, then maybe four, five, you know, let's, you know, there's no, there's no ceiling, you know, I don't, you know, I'm, I, you know, let's try to, let's try to build this channel up as, uh, as, as best we can, you know, and I'd, I'd, I'd love to have you all on the ride with me. So go ahead and do that if, uh, if you so choose to. And again, I'll probably go a little more in depth on, uh, you know, numbers wise when I get home and, uh, I will. And so, yeah, let me know what you guys think. I'll see you guys later.